All right, got Marcus Freeman and uh, Marcus from uh, from Wayne High School. What my sources say that a mighty linebacker for Wayne, and Wayne's always tough. Uh, Ohio State, you were just on the Purdue staff. You're going to be on this staff in, in what capacity? Do you know yet? No, we haven't discussed it. Um, I'm just excited to be a part of his staff and be a part of a man, a, a vision, somebody I care deeply about. You know, when, when Coach Fickle called me and told me he was getting a head coaching job, he didn't have to tell me what my role is. He just told me, he had to tell me he was the head coach and I was going to be here to support him no matter what. I hear a lot of Mark D'Antonio in him because I covered Mark when he was here. His opening remarks were almost identical, looking for, and the key word you keep hearing is toughness. Toughness, relationships, things like that. And I, and I have to assume that's why a guy like you is here. Yeah, I mean, he's a tough human being. And I know him and Coach D'Antonio are very close. Uh, you know, and, and both of them worked under Coach Trestle. And, uh, you know, it's just, it's exciting for him. I know he loves the great state of Ohio. And, and to me, when you think of Ohio football, you think of toughness. Tough kids, you think of tough people, and uh, that's what I assume his program will be all about. And uh, a lot of recruiting needs to be done. Uh, Ohio, as you can vouch for, is a pretty fertile state. I, I know a lot of people say you have to go south to get speed, you need to go south to get athletes, and sure, sure there are some there, but I, I don't think you can discount Ohio. I think it starts in Ohio, and I'm sure it starts in Ohio. And that's why we're excited to, to get going here in the next hour or so of recruiting. And it starts with the committed guys, and then starts in the great state of Ohio, and starts in Cincinnati, and then uh, working your way out. So we're excited to get going. Now you got a preview of these guys week two. I had to yep. cover that game at, at Purdue, and it was actually one of the better games that Cincinnati yep. played over the season. So, you know, I know you're at that point you're dialed in to your team, but did you see anything in the Bearcats at that point? Just they're really good. They were really good when they played. Us and they uh, put a good whooping on us, and uh, they have a lot of talented football players. So I'm excited to get to know who these guys are and get a chance to meet them and to, to work with them, and help them achieve all the goals that we have and they have. I have to assume you guys have a lot of inroads and numerous high schools, including Wayne, who every time I look at Wayne, it's just, boy, you, you can't help but be impressed with the talent they have year after year. Oh, yeah. Coach Minton does a great job uh, at Huber Heights, Wayne, and that goes for the entire state. You know, I know St. X just won Division One state championship down here, and um, we're looking forward to recruiting this city and in the state of Ohio. All right, you look like you're in good shape. Uh, you, you probably dropped a pound or two since the playing days, though. That's what happens when you have a family and kids and you're chasing them around, and, yeah, you try to stay in good shape. All right. He's in good shape, real good shape. Marcus Freeman.